What's up everybody, I'm Eric from Academia Mendix Brazil and we're going to continue with our app, our approval app. We're going to start with new things here, new pages, so we can continue learning uh, Mendix with this uh, playlist. So if you are not subscribed, please subscribe and also thumbs up for this video so we can help this knowledge reach more and more people. So please, thumbs up. Well, let's not waste more time, let's get into it. We have here our project open and here down below you see the stories that we are going to tackle in this video actually we are going to tackle this one as an administrator i want to create added new users so we are going to change the status to in progress and there we go we are going to tackle this story right here and specifically for this video we are going to work with the module administration that's the module that help us to create and maintain users in our application. This module you can see here on the left side of the Studio Pro. Let's expand here. Let's expand Marketplace modules. And we can see here this one called Administration, this one. This is a module that comes from the Mendix Marketplace. You can see here on the right side of this tab here, Marketplace, you can see other uh, modules that you can download. Those modules might be helpful for you in a, another project, in a future project that you're going to be part of it. Anyway, um, just to make sure you guys understand, those modules that you see here under this section comes from the marketplace from Mendix, okay? But once we created the project, this project is already here, so you don't really need to download it again. And uh, remember last video, I put it here, uh, the video, so you can follow uh, this playlist from the very beginning and also uh, watch the last video in case you didn't watch. Uh, we applied security to our application. It makes the application secure and demanding users to log in, to enter, your password, your username, so you can really log into the application. So we're going to make able administrators to create users. Well, let's get into it. So we are going to the navigation of our application, this option right here. Down here, we are going to add a new item. First, I will add a sign out option so our user can sign out. In this icon, I can search for out for instance and can scroll down a little bit and you're going to see uh, this one looks pretty good and here on the on click action we can select sign out and let's click ok very good and now we're going to add a new item here we're going to call it accounts the icon let's look for let's search for user and we can take this one user dash pair and here on the on click, let's show a page. Let's expand the marketplace modules. Let's go to the administration module. And here we can see those folders. Let's open user management, admin, and then we can choose account overview. And let's click OK. So we just added here, I would say the most important page from this module is the uh, page, the overview of accounts that you're going to see from your entire application. And from this page, we can create new users and you can edit new users. Let's drag it up here like this. So we can make it in a, let's say, alphabetical order, Ctrl S so we can save. And that's it, pretty quick, right? Let's run this and see how it works. Great, our application is running. Let's log in as the administrator. Remember, MX admin, password. Let's sign in. There we go. Uh, let's expand here and we see the option accounts. Let's click on it. And those are the users we have at this moment. Let's create here a new user. Let's click here, new local user. Uh, let's add a full name here, Eric, that's my name, username, I'll just put it here, Eric, can be an email, for instance, for example, Eric at, I don't know, mendix.com, uh, user role, you can choose which role did you, this user is going to have, uh, you can have one or more roles, uh, in this case, he's going to be just a regular user, language, uh, for now, it's just English, time zone, uh, you can choose whatever time zone you want. We are not going to choose anything. This is not really relevant for our application. 
in the password, let's edit here a complex password. Let's click save. And there we go. We have our brand new user. Let's create another one. Uh, this is going to be an administrator. And then we can choose the user role administrator, uh, language, time zone, not really relevant. Let's add a complex password save and there we go we have two new users in our application do you see those two users right here they are kind of demo users and uh, if you want to see the application as those users all you got to do is just right click here on this uh, button and then you can choose a demo administrator or a demo user they are like uh, let's say uh, literally demo users so let's click demo user and uh, this is uh, the application with the eyes with the row of a regular user but let's sign out and let's log in as one of those users i've just created let's sign in and there we go our brand new user logged in the application as a user Pretty simple, pretty fast. That's how we can uh, work with users, create and maintain users. Let's go back to Studio Pro because, yeah, we finish uh, one more story. So let's go to the virtual control commit. Let's select the story. Let's add here a message like accounts being created, for instance. And let's click commit and push. And then after committing let's just change the status to done and there we go another story finished well guys as you can see working with uh, the administration module is pretty straightforward it's really simple really easy and you can quickly uh, make your administrator able to create and maintain users in your application well guys this was today's video i hope you like it doubts questions highlights in the comments and i'll see you guys again in the next video Bye-bye.